I am Sandosh Gajankar. Today's concept is about the anti friction bearing. It's suitable, select a suitable ball bearing. We have select a ball bearing here. Required to mount on a shaft. Diameter is 45 mm. Given. Diameter is 45 mm. Withstand radial load of. Radial load I will take as FR. 6 kN. This is 6 into 10 to 3 Newton. And thrust load of F is equal to 3 into 10 to 3 Newton. Thrust load and the rated speed is n is equal to 300 rpm. rpm. The bearing works for 50 hours per week for 3 years. We have to find out L, L is nothing but 50 and it is a week, therefore 52 into 3 into 60 into n value will be 300 divided by 10 to 6. The answer will be 140. Point four millions revolution. This is our yield required. Okay. Next step, I will go for trial one. Trial one. What is the diameter gear of the unit? D is equal to uh, forty-five mm the diameter of the unit. Therefore, I have to select the series two first. I have to select the series two. If this series doesn't work, I will go for the series. Uh, 3. I will refer the page number. I am using the data and book. The data and book. Volume 2. The diameter I will go. This is the diameter. 40. I will write here 40 BC. 0 to 0 to is nothing but series 2. Here I will go for finding 45. Sorry, this is 45. This is for diameter is 45. I will go for 45. 45. Value for this one is nothing but C value, C naught value that is uh, a static will be 21600 and uh, dynamic will be C is equal to 33200. 33200. Okay, this is a neutral, this is a neutral. Neutral. Next, I will go for finding the step one. After knowing this one, I will go for step one. Step one, F A divided by C naught. What is F A? Is nothing but uh, three thousand. That is three. Three into this three divided by C naught is nothing but two one six double zero. The answer is nothing but zero point one three eight eight. Next. By knowing this one, I will find the E value. E value from the data book table. Page number 17. And 72. The E value will be what? This is the E value. What is the uh, FA by AC not is nothing but 0 0.138. What is the 0 0.138? This is the 0 0.138 nothing but 34. One three eight. Now one three eight eight is nothing but I will consider this one as near to eleven. Either you have to consider either zero point one one or zero point one seven. I will consider this one as zero point one seven. Approximate zero point one seven. I will consider. Therefore, the E value for zero point one seven is nothing but zero point three four. You can consider zero point three zero. No problem. You will get the answer. Consider this as a approximate as 0.17. Therefore, E value will be 0. E value will be 0. 0.34. Therefore, after knowing this value, I will go for step two. Step two. Here, F divided by F R. F is nothing but 3000. F R is nothing but 6000. The value will be 0. 0.5, which is greater than E. Greater than it. I have to select here x value. The x value is 0 0.56, it is default value. But y value I have to see here for y value for y uh, 0. This one, the y value will be 1.31. Uh, 1.31. I will take the value y is equal to 1.31. I will go for step 3. Step 3. 
where e is equal to x plus f r plus y f not is equal to k s. What is k s? We have said it. It is a light shock. When it is a light shock, we have to take k is equal to 1.25. It is a steady load. We have to take one as per the procedure. Okay. You are finding the equivalent load. The x value is 0.56 into 6000 plus y is equal to 1.31 into 3000 into 1.25 the answer will be 9112.5 newton one more p you have to write p is equal to fr into ks what is fr 6000 into 1.25 you have to write the value will be what 575 double zero newton. Which one is greater? This is the greater. Select the greater. Select bigger. Value. Okay. Now after getting the bigger value, we are finding the step four. L that is life. We are finding it. L is equal to C divided by P whole cube. What is C? C is already obtained from the data book. Substitute by 3320 divided by P is nothing but 1911 2.5 whole raised to 3. The answer will be 48.361 millions revolution. Million revolution. But our required is 140.4. Therefore, L is less than L required. Bearing is not suitable. Not suitable. Then I will go for trial two. Trial two. Trial two. The diameter is forty-five mm. I will go for series three. Series three. I will go for series three. Okay. The series three. I will go for series three. In the series three, I have to go for forty-five. This is the forty-five. Series three forty-five. This is forty-five. The value for forty-five is nothing but forty-five. The value for forty-five. This is a 45 series 3. The C value will be C naught will be C naught will be 31500 Newton and C is nothing but 52700 Newton. This is the value we obtained it. Once you know this values, once you know this value, follow the same procedure. Follow the same procedure. Step 1. Step 1. FA by C naught. What is FA? FA is nothing but FA is nothing but FA is nothing but 3000 divided by C naught 31500. The answer will be 0 0.0952. Therefore, the E value will be what? The E value will be obtained by using this page number 72. In the handbook. Now it is a zero point zero nine. Zero point zero nine is a thing, but uh, I will consider this one as zero point approximately zero point zero point zero eight four. I will consider the approximate value. Therefore, the E value for this one is nothing but. 0 0.28 I will write the e value 0 0.28 step 2 one more step 2 I have to find out FA divided by FR which is nothing but 3000 divided by 6000 0 0.5 which is greater than E then I have to find out x value x value is nothing but 0 0.56 which is common y value is nothing but the y value can be obtained as 1.55 on the data end is nothing but 
nothing but 1.55 and keep this aside now I will go for step 3 step 3 that is equivalent load step 3 p is equal to x into fr plus y plus f0 into ks ks is nothing but light load therefore we have to, we have to take as 1.25 it is a steady load we have to take as 1 therefore p is equal to x value is nothing but 0 0.56 into uh, f value is nothing but 6000 plus y is nothing but 1.55 into 3000 into 1.25 if you calculate the value will be the value will be 1001 2.5 newton 2.5 newton one more p p is nothing but fr into ks fr is nothing but 6000 into ks is 1.25 the value will be 7500 we have to select the bigger value this is the bigger value bigger value is selected therefore select bigger value after knowing the bigger value step 4 for life l is equal to c d or the p whole q what do you see this is the c value which is often this is the c value which is often in the time book 5 to 7 double 0 divided by p is nothing but 1 0 0 2.5 whole cube the answer will be 145.81 millions revolution that means L is greater than L required the required is nothing but this is the required therefore L is greater than L required this is greater therefore this bearing is selected Therefore, you have to write again. You have to go for the data and book. Here, you have to write diameter 45. Uh, diameter is nothing but bearing number. You have to write bearing number. mm r is nothing but 1.5 mm yeah bearing number is 45 bc03 d is nothing but 100 mm bc025 mm r is nothing but 75 mm which is obtained from the data and book okay i am satosh gayankar thank you very much